It happened back in 53, when I was trying out a new deep dive air supply system in the South Pacific. All the way down, I was followed by a 15-foot shark, which circled around full of curiosity, but made no attempt to attack. I kept wondering how far down he would go. He was still hanging around when I reached the ledge below, which was a great black chasm of enormous depth. It being dangerous to venture further, I stood looking into the chasm while the shark waited for my next move. Suddenly, the water became distinctly colder, while the temperature continued to drop with surprising rapidity. I saw a black mass rising from the darkness of the chasm. It pulsated sluggishly, and I knew that it was alive despite its lack of visible limbs or eyes. Still pulsating, this frightful vision floated past my level. The shark now hung motionless, paralyzed either by cold or fear. While I watched, fascinated, the enormous thing reached the shark, contacted him with its upper surface and the shark gave a convulsive shiver and was drawn unresistingly into the substance of the monster. I stood perfectly still, not daring to move, while the dark thing sank back into the chasm as slowly as it had emerged. Darkness swallowed it, and the water started to regain some warmth. God knows what this thing was. But I had no doubt that it had been born of the primeval slime, countless fathoms below.